Hey, this is Gloria coming to you to share with you uh, my project for the month of March. This is the third project that is being created for the Prima Dow uh, collaboration that's being uh, hosted here on YouTube. And this month's project theme needed to be uh, green and we had to use a shamrock. And of course, uh, this is the month for St. Patrick's Day, which is March 17th. So that's why we are doing green and shamrocks. So what you see before you is part of my project. The uh, paper that I used is from Hobby Lobby. It's open stock from Hobby Lobby. And what I decided to do is create a box for my Prima Dow tag and this box is inspired by Bona who is live love and scrap she has lots of uh, tutorials on projects that she has created for the Prima Dows and I was just ecstatic when I found that video and was able to make this box so basically it's fairly simple as you can see and all that I did was uh, use craft cardstock to create my box here. And I layered it with some green cardstock. And then I layered it again with the, <coughs> excuse me, I layered it again with the uh, green pattern paper. And just put a couple shamrock, uh, glitter shamrock uh, foam stickers here in the corners. This is just a flower I had in my stash and I put another flower center. These uh, letters are, oh let me see, these letters are embellishments that, let me see, but I purchased them, this is not quite the ones that I use, but I purchased these chipboard um, letter pieces. Uh, from a uh, local um, dollar store here. It's not the Dollar Tree, but it's a store that is like everything, nothing over $2. And so um, I purchased these letters here. These is not the particular ones that I used on my project, but they're a box of uh, letterings like this. So anyway, I just uh, put on there the word lucky across here. You know, luck of the Irish and lucky charms or whatever it is I don't know but anyway that's all I did with my uh, box I didn't do very much to that but on the inside is a tag and this is my tag that I created with my Prima Dow the Prima Dow that I used uh, this time is Megan this is Megan and if you can see her top doesn't have any sleeves on it. It's a sleeveless top here. But I created her with um, some sleeves, a little shirt underneath her uh what in the world did I do? Oh, that's the paper. I don't see the pattern on here. Okay, that's just the, the, the paper. This is a, I cut it out in an, a, a, another uh, pattern paper. But anyway, I put a uh, top underneath to look like it's underneath her sleeveless dress. Okay, anyway, this is Megan. And I cut her out on, on craft card stock. She has a little glitter band. I used some gl green uh, glue stickle going across there. Uh, put her on a, a little leprechaun hat. I just googled uh, leprechaun hats and just cut that out and kind of put that on there and um, her boots she has on some green boots and I just kind of put that little glitter sticker stickle on the edge of her boots as well just lined her dress out with some flowers and then here I have a rainbow and a pot of gold on the end here and there again I just googled this and then just uh, fussy cut that out added my gl gl green glitter shamrocks this is a die a spellbind spellbinders die I just cut out here and then just ink the edges and there again it's another type of a uh, pattern paper that I got both these also came from Hobby Lobby and I just uh, backed my 
tag, layered my tag with some more green cardstock and then layer, layered it with the pattern paper and just added this uh, green seam binding at the top. So this is my tag and it is housed in my box. And I think it's cute. I like uh, her little hat. And I like that I was able to, like I said, add like a little shirt underneath her dress. Gives it a, a little bit of a different look from the, the way that the uh, actual doll is. Alright, well, that's my project for the month of March. The third Prima doll in this collaboration. And be sure to check out the links below and all of the ladies that are participating in this collaboration. And you enjoy your weekend. Thank you. Bye.